Welcome, welcome, welcome to part 9 of the Adventures of Vanky. And here I go, taking on the last Pokemon trainer here in the Verdian Forest. And then I can move on to uh, face Brock and his rock solid defense. Yep, nothing better than that. So I'm just going to try and breeze through this person. So I'll just use my Charmander right off the bat. And I think this person may have dropped something on the ground, if I remember correctly. It's been a while. Oh, my God. Scorched Earth, you, and I can just get on with this battle. Jesus Christ, Caterpie. Okay. Oh, yep, found the hidden potion there. Go me. Alright, so if I remember, this person's tough because he or she only has one Pokeball, right? Yep, and it's probably going to be a strong Weedle. See, level 9, look at that. Abnormally strong, but no match for my Charmander. Because it's dead in one hit. So, that was really easy. So, why don't you just go cry home to your mommy, Sammy? Okay, I already found that stuff you're looking on the ground. And this is a Pikachu, I hope. No, it's a Kakuna. Where? Ugh, God, I hope that wasn't like the only time I'm ever going to see a Pikachu. But I feel like it is. Oh my god. Come on, I just need a Pikachu. A Puchaki. Not a Caterpie. On the bright side, I guess this is quickly leveling up my Charmander. Mm, maybe I'll, I'll give it like three more attempts. And uh, if I don't find a Pikachu, I might just have to give up. And then just keep doing this like off camera until I actually find a Pikachu. And then I'll start rolling again and recording. <coughs> When's it gonna learn Metal Claw? Oh, there you go. Speak of the devil. Speak of the dinosaur, that is. Because <laughs> Charmander's like a mini T Rex, like from the land before time. Like Chomper. I, I'm not really sure where I was going with that, but. Alright, this is getting slightly awkward, and I'm just the person actually saying this, so. Alright, I'm just gonna use Metal Claw. That's pretty cool. Strong attack, too. Let's see what its attributes are. Hang on. So, summary. Let me go to moves. It's a steel type, which is, means it's effective against rock, so I am not screwed for Brock. Attacks with steel claws, and it also raises the user's attack, so it's pretty good. 50 firepower. Ember has 40. Scratch has 40. That's interesting that these actually do the same amount of damage. Well, I guess the Ember is like a special attack. So, here you can see 24, so Ember would do a lot more damage than an attack, which just has 22. Alright, let's try. Fanky needs a new Pikachu. And it's a Kakuna. That's just terrific. Okay, well, obviously my luck isn't really that great, so you know what, I'm just going to go get a Pikachu off camera, and I'm just, first of all, I'm just going to go forward ahead and face Brock, because I'm getting really impatient. And look for, okay, nice blue hair you got there, lady. Evo Devo. Route 2. Actually, any good Pokemon in here? Anything? A Ratatat. Level 3, you are so weak. I could eat you alive. Hmm. 
My dinosaur will demolish you. Alright, last chance. Show me something good. Pidgey. Level 4. Yeah. Not gonna cut it. Alright, so let us go explore Pewter City. Pewter City. Oh, no, never mind. Hang on, this is a tip. Let me talk to this fat dude. But Pewter City's Brock isn't like that. Not one bit. He is tough as rock nails. Let's see what this old man has to say. Pokemon learns some new techniques. Oh my god. Alright, catch Pokemon when there's like a status effect like sleeping, poison, paralyzed, whatever. Common sense. Go to the Pokemon Center. See what people say. Team Rocket. Team Rocket. They are the bad guys. In this game. They are the villains. The antagonists. These dudes are twins. And they're trading Pokemon. That's cute. That is cute. What? Tell me something good about yourself. What's your profile? Yes, no info? Yes? I am a Pokemon friend. Um. <laughs> okay. I'm fickle? For doing what? <laughs> okay, you're a weird lady. I'm just gonna go visit my best friend here with the yellow hat. <laughs> oh, it's Jigglypuff. You just look like a circle with two googly eyes and like a little weird toupee on the head. Mm, yeah, I'm really tired. Wow. All right, maybe next video I will take on Brock. Do you know what I'm doing? No, I don't know what you're doing. I'm spraying Repel to keep wild Pokemon on my garden. Very smart. Repel is an item you can buy in the shop. It's just like uh, one of these items here, and basically it keeps Pokemon away. So when you're in the grass, you don't always have to fight them. But uh, check out Bear Gator's video if you haven't seen it yet. It really uh, demonstrates it well in Diglett's Cave. And your trainer, right? Brock's looking for new challengers. Follow me. Well, I did not have a choice at all, so I will follow you. Dun. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, you guys can't hear the music, but it's actually pretty cheerful right now. Like, I'm just gonna battle this dude. <coughs> Alright, well, I don't really want to take on Brock right now. I'm just gonna go explore the city. And this is a hottie. Woo! I'm talking about Clefairy coming from the moon. Great. And, I swear to God, I thought there was like. I feel like there's always something hidden around here. I don't know, maybe it's just me. It's probably just me. Yeah, whatever. Mm, that's a nice house over there. Let's see. If I talk to one of these dudes, they take me to the Museum of Science. But I forget who. So I'm just going to end this video right here for now.